lettuce eat. She's lettuce eat, and you're in for a treat when you watch lettuce eat. Dollar Tree clean with me, zoning and decluttering. Zaire, Jacqueline, Dave doing his thing. Dutch oven meal hacks. She's coming back. She's coming back. We are at Aldi and we're going to be doing a lunch grocery haul. We're going to do some price comparison to Walmart. We do grocery hauls. We have a playlist linked down below. We also do giveaways every 100 subscribers. We'll get into that a little later in the video. I'll show you everything at home. We'll go over our meal plan as well as the receipt. And we are in Aldi. And when you walk in, they have the chips. Unlike most of the supermarkets in my area, you walk into the produce section, depending on which door you go in. Their Clancy brand is pretty good. And they're about comparable to Walmart's price, sometimes a little cheaper. They have salsa and guacamole, all kinds of snacks. And this caught my eye for snacking, because you gotta have snacks after lunch or with lunch. $3.29. I'm gonna get the avocado. I'm gonna get a bag of these. My kid likes them and so do I. And they're $2.19. You get a little bit more than Dollar Tree. I'm gonna get a box of the blueberry mini muffins for $2.75 for lunchbox fillers and snacks. Granola bars, a great lunch snack idea, $1.69. I love yogurt and I like it for a quick lunch or an extra with my lunch. I'm gonna get a couple of blueberries and a peach. Rather than deli meat, Check it out these hams, right? and you can heat them up and slice them up and make a boatload of sandwiches or even make salads for wraps. Here's a classic guacamole for $1.79. I'm going to get the provolone for $1.89. It'll go perfect with the ham. Aldi has all kinds of seasonal stuff. You check it out. This is really nice. 15. That's stuff for the kitchen. We got our shower curtains here years ago. Aldi is also great for pantry staples to make wraps with. A dollar twenty-nine. If fresh tomatoes are too expensive, check out their diced tomato selection at a dollar nine. If you're at Walmart's, Walmart's are eighty-eight cents a can for their brand. Also for lunches are soups, and they're a great alternative. You can have it with a sandwich, and they have a creamy potato, and they're $1.68. Also, they have the Sloppy Joe's sauce. It is 95 cents. That would be cheaper than the Dollar Tree. For a good buy, and just grab some rolls and some ground beef. Make a great lunch. And for those sandwiches, grab some buns at $1.29. We are going to the register. I'm going to check out. We'll let you know what we spent and show you everything. Prices have gotten really high, so it's going to be more than I anticipated to spend. But that's okay. A lot of prices are cheaper than Walmart. Other prices are not. Always price compare. We are going to be packing our own bags. If you've never been into the Audi before, you have to pay for your cart out front. It's a quarter. Or sometimes people just give you the cart and you give them the quarter and pay it forward. And then you bag your own products. They do this to keep prices low, and they like you to have your own bags, they do sell them. My husband put everything in the trunk, and he returned the cart back to the front of the store, and we got about two weeks worth of lunches for around $50. We're going to go over things on the receipt at home with the meal plan of what I'm going to be doing with all the items that we picked up at Aldi today. We're back from Aldi. In a moment, we'll go over everything on the table. If you're new, we do giveaways every 100 subscribers. They are $10 gift cards. The information for the gift card giveaways are listed down below. We're not responsible for lost or stolen prizes by mail. We also looking for five people to give out one gift card. Same rules apply. If you're new, comment in order to qualify so we know who to shout out. You need to be subscribed to the United States residents. We have a newsletter. You can email me, countryboots1268 at yahoo.com. My social sites are linked down below with all of our playlists. Let's take a look at what's in our bag and go over all the items two weeks worth of lunch. Here's everything on the table that we picked up from Aldi. I'm going to start with the spiral ham that I picked up and it's already sliced thin and you can probably slice it even thinner if you have a meat slicer at home and you can chop it up and cube it up and make it into a nice ham salad or just regular ham and cheese sandwiches. You can get those rolls that I have. 
You can put ham and then cheese and then the top and put it into the oven for great ha hot ham sandwiches. And then there are the pretzels. And they're really good and good for dipping. I'll dip my guacamole. And David grabbed these for a lunch snack after a sandwich. They're kettle chips. And then these are the garlic and sea salt. He loves garlic. Now for the lunches, I'm going to spread this ham out. I believe it's fully cooked. So that's going to be very easy to do. And you're just going to heat it. It looks like a good quality spiral ham. And it's going to make a lot of sandwiches. And you can freeze what you don't use. You can make a big batch of ham salad with mayonnaise and the diced tomatoes. And spread it out for over two weeks period. So you're not having it every single day. Let's go over the receipt. Here are the prices from the Aldi receipt. $3.79 for the deli style avocado guacamole. Fire roasted tomatoes were $1.09. $11 for the ham. Sloppy Joe's, 95 cents for that mix. For the yogurts, 59 cents each. For the premium guacamole, $3.29. For the sliced cheese, each one was $1.89. The soup was $2.99. Mini muffins were $2.75. And the granola bars were $1.65. Pretzels were $2.19. The chips that David got were $2.49. And the buns were $1.29. And we spent $40.98. So $40, $10 shy of $50. That's two weeks worth of lunches. And you're going to make it in batches. You're going to spread it out over the next couple weeks. Put some in the freezer. Put some in the fridge. So you're not eating the same thing every single day. And you're going to make that more versatile for you. And you're going to save money because you're going to be making things and then using your leftovers. We always use our leftovers for lunches. And I have a turkey that we just took care of and we roasted it and I froze it so I can take out turkey later within the month for our lunches. I can make soup or I can make a dinner. It's very, very helpful and very, very frugal and budget friendly to utilize your leftovers and to shop smart and do batches of what you shop so you can make the extra food for quick lunches or quick dinners or whenever you need something. My meal planning board is specified for dinner. This is just to give you a, a visual. And we do theme nights. We do an Italian night. We do pork, beef, chicken. You can do a similar meal plan with lunch. We normally don't ever plan our lunches. It's usually what's just left over or lunch meat or some kind of sandwich or soup and sandwich. Or even a simple yogurt for myself. The shirt is a tribute band that comes to my area on occasion for Def Leppard. Spelled differently as you noticed. And they are phenomenal. So if you ever get a chance to see these guys in your area, please do. Because they are worth it. A little different of a grocery haul for you today from Aldi. Two weeks worth of lunches for around 40 bucks. If you're new... Don't forget about those giveaways. The information is listed down below. We do do gift cards that are not every other 100 subscribers, and we're looking for five people. The information is listed down below. My social sites are linked down below with my email and all of our playlists. Have a fantastic day. Smash on that subscribe board, and thank you for watching.